Hello, I am here to do my November wine unboxing for the Wine of the Month Club, and I chose to do it on my birthday. Um, and I thought I would share with you this lovely birthday card that I got. Basically says, remember, birthday fun does not have to come out of a bottle. And inside it says, there's wine in a box. And I said, yes, and it comes to my house every month with this wonderful Wine of the Month Club. So, let's get to it. Try not to uh, injure ourselves. Now that we're at that age where they ask you questions, if you feel like you're, do you feel like you're safe in your own house? Anyway, let's see what we have today. We have a Wine Discoveries Wine Ambassador Grenache. We also have the Discoveries uh, Pinot Noir. I suppose I should put on my glasses so I can read these things. Well packaged, as usual. Huh. I don't think I have the tasting notes card. Hmm. Also interesting to note that this month it came in a plain brown box, not our usual wine ambassador box with the QR code on it. Ah, we have a bottle of the 2019 Freedom Chardonnay. And we have another bottle of the Discoveries 2019 Sauvignon Blanc. So, ah, the card. It's at the bottom this time. Either that or I opened it wrong. Anyway, there's a QR code that you can get the wine tasting notes on it. Oh, more shipping stuff. Anyway, and to continue my journey of things I've learned about wine, I thought it has come to my attention that in order to enjoy your wine, you need the proper glasses. So, I have an array of different glasses here, and I'm trying to figure out exactly which one you use for the wine. So, my thought is, these are for the bright sparkling wine. So, you know, kind of like the sun doesn't get in your eyes. I'm not sure which one of these. This may also be good for the freedom because, you know, Sometimes there's fireworks going off and they could be pretty bright. If not that, then there's these kind of night vision glasses. That's probably for the really, really dark wines. Maybe. I don't know. And then I have various shades. These are my blue light readers. Although I don't know that any of these wines put off blue light. Oh, well. I have a choice just in case I need it regular reading glasses, and then reading glasses with a higher power to read the fine print on that Grenache label that I couldn't read before. So, what? This isn't right? Oh, apparently this is not the type of glasses you need for wine. Hmm, let me check what I got in my bag for my birthday. Well, Looks like we got some cool wine stoppers, a corkscrew, that'll come in handy. Cause you know, I finally tasted some of this stuff on Thanksgiving day. Oh my gosh. I had to get this unboxing done so I could have some before I go to bed. Some of those little cool wine, uh, mark your glass things. I don't know what they're called. Oh look. Proper wine glasses. Amazing. All right. Well, I think I will do a little more research on the type of glasses needed for wine, but I will have to give these a try. So this is, like I said, the November wine unboxing. It is 12, 12, 21. Uh, I had to get this done because my December wine should be coming soon. Anyway, uh, catch up with us next month. If you're interested in the wine of the month club, uh, and you can get some fine wines like this because, you know, I'm not really a wine drinker, but let me tell you, I like this stuff. Um, you can check out my website at 4g29.com slash fine dash wines and uh, 
Check back next month and we continue my journey on discovering more and more about wine. Thank you.